Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of these nice brand sandwiches. These are a Walgreens brand. These were a dollar at Walgreens, of course. It says Bready, Set, Enjoy. Um, this is the chicken sandwich, the breaded one. It's breaded chicken patty on a sesame seed bun. There's, I don't look like there's any cheese or anything like that. One sandwich is in the box. 420 calories, so it's not a low calorie sandwich. Um, sodium's a little high, but not super, super bad. So let's see the directions. Um, I've actually put this, uh, cause I made a hamburger uh, before and it said the best to thaw it. So I thawed this overnight, it's been in the refrigerator. So we're gonna open the end of the sandwich and microwave it high for 40 to 50 seconds. I'll probably do 45 seconds in this microwave. Um, can be stored in the refrigerator up to 14 days. So uh, when you get these home, if you know you're gonna eat them over the next week or so, go ahead and stick them in your refrigerator and see your freezer and then they'll last for two weeks that way. So um, 45 seconds for me. You know, the box already. So. Uh, that's a pretty good size sandwich. Um, like I said, there's nothing on there. It's just a plain chicken sandwich. Um, I love um, CD buns, so that'll be good. So I'm gonna open this package and put it on this paper plate and microwave it and I'll be back. All right, here it is out of the microwave and all I've done is open the plastic bag, so. Ooh, steamy. That's it. So I'm gonna let it sit for a minute. Um, it's not crispy by any means, it's kind of soft, but it's definitely breaded, but it's not crispy. So, which you necessarily expect in the microwave. So again, it's plain, there's no cheese, no anything. Um, I do have some mustard. I may put that on there after I do the review just to spice it up a little bit, but we'll see, see what it tastes like. So I'll be back once it's cooled off. Hey, it says time, time to cool off. So I'm gonna take a bite of it. It's just, like I said, just chicken sandwich. Not bad flavor. The bread is good and tender. Um, there is some spices in there, not spicy hot, but just spices. Um, like salt, pepper, that kind of thing. You can taste a little bit of the spices in there. Um, it's a little plain. Um, some cheese or some, some mustard will definitely help it. Um, I'm not gonna put cheese on it just because it adds extra calories, but you could put cheese or something on this. Um, overall, it's not a bad sandwich at all for a dollar. It's a pretty good deal for a dollar. You get a pretty good size sandwich, um, something you would like you would make at home. It is a pressed chicken mm -hmm. patty, so it's not a like filleted, I guess, chicken pat, uh, chicken breast or anything. It is like um, chicken that's been ground up and pressed into a patty, then breaded. The breading again is not crispy, but it is breaded. You can tell it's breaded. Um, could have been a little crispier, I guess. Maybe somehow. I don't know. I don't know. It's not dry though. It's very good and moist. Um, you know, sometimes the edges of chicken gets kind of dry and hard. Um, this one's good and tender. The bread's good and tender all over. Um, pretty good sandwich. So I'm going to give this one, honestly, I'm going to give it a four. It could use a little more spice in the chicken, but um, I think you can overcome that by adding your own salt and pepper and um, some mustard mayo, whatever you like on your chicken. Um, Honey mustard, that would be really good. So, um, so anyway, yeah, I'm gonna give this one a four. Really good quality, really good size. I think you get good value for money and a pretty good, decent meal. So, hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching.